Hey everyone, I just wanted to mix things up a little bit on this video and showcase two open high, low close uh, stat map type indicators uh, that you can utilize. They're open source, they're out there, they're free, and I love them both. Uh, so let me, that's what this video is about. It won't be too long, but I just wanted to jump in here and make you guys aware of these. So the fir first one here that you see on the screen, I'm on the one hour chart. Uh, this is the daily distribution levels. This one's called open high. Actually, let me just jump in here. This will be the easiest for you. This one's called open high, low close, stat map, multi time frame. And this is produced or made by Lucy Maros. And you can see all the information in here about what it does, how it computes things, all that good stuff. Again, open high, low close, stat map, multi time frame. I uh, absolutely uh, love this one. And then the other one that you may have seen me showcase a lot is this one here. This one is called, uh, let me just go up in here. This one's called Session Stats by this gentleman here, DC77. This guy makes a lot of great stuff as well. This one here is, is invite only. Uh, but if you go on TradingView, I'll have the link in the description. Go on here and if you ask nicely, <laughs> he will probably give you access to this because I know a few weeks back um, when I talked about this, he reposted or made a comment basically saying, hey, if you want this, drop me a, a, a message on TradingView and that's what people have done in here. Um, you can see they put their, their TradingView username all through here. So anyway, again, session stats, DC77, you can see what it looks like right here. Very powerful. And I will have the link on the video description for this guy as well. But like I said, just wanted to showcase both of these. And this is what they look like overlapped. And you can see how powerful that is. Probably some minor differences in the way that they compute whatever they're doing in the background there. But I'm telling you, between your edge, whatever strategy that you have, in addition to looking at the statistics overall, from a historical perspective, um, it just gives you an extra edge, I, I, I really feel, in terms of um, you know, where the manipulation area is, where the distribution area is. I mean, you can see this is market open here. You can see it came down. Well, actually, this, it dumped, came down, hit manipulation. It came down here, and now we're going up again. And you'll, you'll see this. If you follow me on X, you'll see a lot of my screenshots that, that do this. It'll go up to the manipulation area, either rock it down or rock it up. Um, but uh, very, very powerful. Another thing that I, I wanted to showcase and, and just point out real quick here is let me minimize this. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to preach this again. You guys have probably heard me talk about this. Um, this, is the four, this is the typical four hour profile that's going on right here. Got the 1800 candle, the 2200 candle. So we got the reversal within the Asia, Asia, Asian session. <laughs> I can't even say that right. And then the turnaround within London and New York. I will post the, the description to this particular video as well and on my video here. But you guys need to watch this because the four hour candles are a key, I believe. And, and it's really opened my eyes to what the market is gonna do the next day. Now, granted, the market's been really crazy with the tariffs and things like that, but if you if you watch the four hour candles with the way that uh, Asia and London play out, you can almost, you know, I won't say 100%, but you've got a pretty good feeling of what's gonna happen uh, in the New York session based on what the previous couple of four hour candles uh, did. So, just wanna mention that real quickly. I don't wanna take the spotlight off of, uh, uh, the other indicators but it just made me think because today is a is it's, it's it's i've seen this over and over you guys have seen me post this on x and uh, it's it's just playing out beautifully again so one more time you got the open high close stat map multi time frame pull it up one more time here ohlc stat map multi multi time frame by lucy maros and then the other one you probably will not be able to see since it's an invite only, but I will have the link in the description to this session stats indicator. All right, 
Hope that helps you guys out. And I will catch you on the next video, guys. Have a great week ahead.